So you've got yourself a GoPro Hero 11 Black and you're wanting to use it as a webcam in Windows 11. Today we're going to show you exactly how to set that up. So let's dive into it. All right, so here we are on my Windows 11 desktop. Go ahead and open up your favorite browser. I'm going to be using Chrome today and you can do a quick search for GoPro 11 webcam. And when you go through the results here, you should see an option that says GoPro community right here, how to use your GoPro as a webcam. You can go ahead and left click on that. Should be one of the top results. I will have it linked below in the description. Now, once that page loads up, you should see a few different options here. So instructions for Mac. So you can use this for a Mac. We're doing this on Windows 11 today. So we're gonna go to the Windows section here. Um, you can do it with Windows 10 or 11. And you should see the option here that says download and get started. You can go ahead and left click on that. And that's gonna take you to where you can get started. So a couple quick things I should mention. First off, you do need to have the most recent update to your GoPro. So make sure your GoPro is updated. You can do that with the GoPro app on your phone. The GoPro Quick app. Now, the other thing it does say here is some people are having problems with their firmware and it should be updated soon. But if you are having problems, you will need to do a connections reset on your GoPro. So I'll show you quickly how to do that right now and then we'll set up the utility. So on your GoPro from the main screen, just swipe down from the top. You'll see some options here. We wanna swipe from right to left. So right to left and you should see the preferences option here. Just go ahead and tap on that. And we're looking for the wireless connections option right here. So wireless connections and you'll click on that and scroll to the bottom, the very bottom, and you'll see reset connections here. Just go ahead and tap on that. Are you sure all connections will be reset to default settings? Hit reset and it'll reset those settings for you and restart your GoPro. So our next step here is to install and launch the GoPro webcam app. So there's a little link here to download it. It says GoPro webcam desktop utility. You can go ahead and left click on that and it's gonna open up a new web page for you. And at the very top here, you should see the download option. You can go ahead and left click on that and it should start downloading that for you automatically to wherever your downloads go on your computer. Mine go into my downloads area. You can see it right there. I'm actually gonna copy that to my desktop here so we can uh, close this out. So once you've got that downloaded, you can go ahead and left click on it or double click on it and it should load up and it says welcome to the GoPro webcam setup wizard. So let's go ahead and hit next here. It's gonna give you a user agreement. You can read through that and accept the terms and then hit next. Click install to begin the installation. So we can go ahead and click install here. And I had a little pop up that asked me if I wanted to continue. I just said yes to that. It didn't record that part. It says completed the GoPro webcam setup wizard, click the finish button to exit the setup wizard. So we're gonna go ahead and hit finish. And it says a GoPro webcam setup. You must restart your system for the configuration changes made to GoPro webcam to take effect. So I'm gonna go ahead and restart my system and then I'll come right back to you. All right, so it's time to set up our GoPro. I've got my system all restarted there. On the side of your GoPro, you've got the little door. You can pull down the lever and open up your side door just like that. And you can grab your USB-C cable. You can use the one that came with your GoPro or maybe you have a longer one. I actually have an extension, so I'm gonna extend it from my computer to this. So I'll go ahead and plug that into my camera there on the side and I'm gonna plug that into my extension here. And if you need an extension, maybe I'll I'll put some links to some cables and extensions below in the description. So you can see I've got that plugged in there. The little red light's on. I'm going to go ahead and push the button and turn on my GoPro. Just like that. And I'm going to set this up here. So back here in Windows, once you've got that all plugged in and set up, you'll have the GoPro Windows app on here. And it does create a shortcut here in the bottom right hand corner. So if you click on your little up arrow in the notifications or icons area, you should see a little camera or GoPro in here with a blue light. And if I left click on that, I get some options here and I can go ahead and click preview and it'll open up a window here and it should preview that. There we go. You can see myself there. You can adjust the size. 
And once you've got that open as well, if you go back down to the bottom right hand corner and there's the GoPro icon, it's red now that it's showing it's working. If I left click on that again, we can actually change our lenses in here as well. So we can go from linear, whether it's on now, to super view. There we go, super view. Or let's see here. There's wide and narrow. So you can pick whichever one you like there. Maybe I'll put it on wide. Now I did want to show you if we jump over and you want to use this in a meeting or something. If I'm over in say Gmail and I want to use it in a meet meeting, we can just start a new meeting here. Um, you'll have to set it up as your camera. So you'll have to go into the settings of whether it's Zoom or Meet and change it in the settings to this camera. So for example, in Meet here, I can go to the settings here at the bottom or more options, settings, and under video here, we can find, it's right now it's set to my Logitech webcam. We can find our GoPro there. There it is, the GoPro webcam. Select that and the maximum resolution wired like this is 720p. We'll just click that and now I can use the webcam or the GoPro as a webcam in Google Meet or you can use it in Zoom or whatever other program you're using. And really it's that simple to set up your GoPro Hero 11 Black as a webcam here in Windows 11. So hope this tutorial was able to help you get set up with your GoPro as a webcam. If this video did give you value, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media and subscribe here on YouTube. I'd love to have you join the Northern Viking community. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.